much. And first up on our GMA Heat Index, Empire star Taraji P. Henson speaking about racial profiling, claiming her son was a victim of profiling while visiting the University of Southern California. ABC's Brandy Hitt has the story. You need to stop playing with me. She plays the no-nonsense music matriarch on Fox's hit TV show Empire, who stops at nothing to defend her son. I want you to always remember I got you. Now, actress Taraji Henson is standing up for her real-life 20-year-old son, Marcel, telling Uptown Magazine, my child has been racially profiled, alleging two run-ins with police. He was in Glendale, California, and did exactly everything the cops told him to do, including letting them illegally search his car, she claims. They didn't give him the ticket for what he was pulled over for. She also alleges, then he's at University of Southern California, the school I was going to transfer him to, when police stopped him for having his hand in his pockets. She was very energetic and very passionate. Why should she commit and spend over $50,000 of her money somewhere where her son is not going to feel safe and secure? I think it highlights that these things aren't limited to certain people in certain communities, but that it can happen to anyone from someone in a low-income community to someone who's the son of a really big movie star. Henson declined our interview request for further details, and the city of Glendale told ABC News it can't comment on accusations without more information about when and where this alleged incident happened. USC's public safety chief also wants more details so they can look into it. We encourage reporting of allegations of bias and I hope for the opportunity to have a conversation with the young man and his mother. My baby is a superstar. It may be too late. The Oscar-nominated actress telling Uptown she's now sending her son to her own alma mater, Howard University. For Good Morning America, Brandy Hitt, ABC News, Los Angeles. Cookie. All right, Brandy, yeah. thank you. <laughs> Next up.